What's up, YouTube? You're watching Mike Plays Blind, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die. So, there's a few missing videos between where we are now and uh, where we've been. The first one, I tried to go to the school, and um, I figured, you know, school, there'd be brothers. But no, I guess the dumbest kids in Arizona go to school in Navsgain because I think there were only three bookshelves in that entire school. So we didn't learn anything. The video was terrible because... You know, the one of my only complaints with the, the update to Alpha 14 is the, like, vacuumous darkness, where I swear it absorbs light. So inside that school, like, you could not see anything. Uh, today we're out testing the blunderbuss, which apparently sucks. Or at least sucks until you're higher level. And uh, we're still on our uh, quest for knowledge. As you can see, it is now day 10. I, um, spent day 9 trying to go to, uh... Um, the Shaka Messiah that's up there in the frozen north, but, uh, the problem there was, uh, recording. I had, uh, I use an NVIDIA GPU, and recently there was a, uh, patch released for it that caused, you know, a lot of difficulty with recording audio on a lot of the games that I play, that, uh, it either won't come through clearly, or it's distorted, or, you know, any number of other problems, really. Um, essentially, my push-to-talk microphone will not turn off now. I have to disconnect it, which is what the kind of audio irregularities in this video or in um, the one you really notice it in is uh, oh, whoops, um, the Imperion videos I just shot. You'll hear like some static and some noises here and there in the background. It's because I can't turn off the push-to-talk mic and said I have to disconnect it. But anyway, hopefully NVIDIA gets that worked out. So, uh, today... <laughs> I know these houses have a couple of bookshelves in them. I thought it'd be a good way to take out the blunderbuss. It's our last chance for books. If we don't get books here, well, we're probably not going to get them at all. And nothing. Into the bedroom. Where's your books? Show me your books. Are there still more zombies outside? Oh, my God. So I'm going to kind of just do a run through of this house real quick. We're going to search things here and there. But my main concern really is just the books. Nothing. I mean, we're going to grab other things we can. We'll probably hit the safes. But we'll kind of get to that point where I need progress. Kitchen. me. Where's the books? I think they're upstairs. I better not be like misremembering being books in this house either. Any books in there? This is now my universal door opener as well. And I guess we'll go back to the axe. Anything? Nothing. Ah, you guys are already coming in too. I went to the bow by accident. Which is probably good, because that blunderbuss sucks. Uh, you're flying. Well, flying guys get the blunt. Yeah, I hope that hurt a lot. They're probably reloading. Are you serious? God, this thing is worthless. Didn't even stun him. And I can't even change weapons now. Look at that one arrow to the head, now you're dead. I'm not really concerned with the integrity of this house, so we're just going to leave them to their... Th oh, you too, huh? We ought to stay here and you guys will fall off there. Please be a bunch of bookcases. Here, have... Okay, and if for some reason it killed you in one shot. Nothing. So yeah, apparently these guys turn into gore blocks like as soon as you loot them now, and that's kind of... I think that killed her. I thought I'd clear this town out before I started shooting today, but uh, I guess not. Are you serious? Is there no, book no bookcase in here? I swear, I remember there being tons of bookcases in this house. 
Maybe my memory is just toast. Did I miss a room? I did miss a room. Okay, well, you look like a blunderbuss zombie. And one more. Nope, stay back. I thought the blunderbuss also would slow them down somehow. Are you kidding me? Oh, that was a miss. That was a clear miss on my part. Uh, see downstairs. And... Oh, that was a miss. Alright, who else is out here? No one? Alright. No one for real, okay. Have that. Are you dead? You're dead. Okay. Where's the nurse? Where's the nurse? She's still up there. Okay, good. And are you kidding me? So just fall down. Yep, yep. And... and you're alive. And you're alive. Okay, I'm now becoming almost amazed with how bad this blunderbuss is. I realize it's like starting to tear down, and that's probably part of the problem. So, I've only played around this a little bit, and I thought it was at least decent before. I don't think I've even put 50 rounds through it. All right, well, whatever. Maybe it's been nerfed. I don't know. Oh, shit. It almost seems like it has to have been. Wait a minute, what's under the stairs? A bookcase! With a pipe wrench book in it. All right, back bedroom. Oh, we had more wrench. Well, I guess that's that's good. we got to stay positive, right? All right, so door. Yeah, come here. Better be like, I don't even know what in here. Just the gun safe. Oh, bookcase. All right, perfect. Come on, crossbow. Mini bikes for dummies, which I can't remember if we have yet. Um, let's find out. There's our airdrop. Apparently, they're still glitched. We will forego this one. I still seem to be getting them every day or close. Oh, you know what? Actually, maybe it has been three days since I saw one on here. Well, either way. That drop is probably where the crossbow schematic is, too. Or maybe we'll get really lucky and there'll be one in this gun safe. Two more houses to search after this one, but I could have sworn this was the one that had like three bookcases in it. And it had two, which I guess isn't terrible. I'm almost afraid to change like the loot respawn time. Uh, nothing that really helps us. We still don't have a shotgun schematic. Let me search you. Or maybe it's that house. Maybe it's the house with the pool that has all the uh, everything we need in it. We're gonna do a run through of this one real quick, even though I don't think this has it. I'm using the pick, uh, the pick, not the axe. Uh, I did just like let the zombies obliterate these houses, by the way, because I don't plan on ever coming back here. Okay, good. Two bookcases. Nothing. And more nothing. Toilet gun? No. I did find two toilet guns in the school, by the way. Nothing useful, just like, um, we found a lot of bodies in the school, especially up on the roof, bodies in duffel bags. Seriously, how'd you die in here? Eh, uh, safe. Why not? 
Uh, well, Sarah's treasure map. Okay, well, that's good. Uh, scrap, toss. Uh, 189 pistol barrel. I think the one we have is better, but I can't remember. I know we have a better hunting rifle stock. Don't remember about receiver. More magnum parts. Oh, we have a 44 magnum now, too. We got all the parts for that in the school. Go figure. And scrap some more. And you know what? Let's check the safe view. I seem to find more schematics in these small safes anyway, so... Maybe this is where it's hiding. So yeah, if we don't find a crossbow schematic today, I probably will spend tomorrow off camera anyway, just getting our base ready for the horde again. And then we'll get back to at least doing a little bit of searching. It's only day 10, so obviously you know we've got four days. But I don't know where else to search besides like hitting I mean, I guess we could go hit, uh, see, look here, two, two schematics, which I'm pretty sure we have this one. We are going to read all of them anyway. And I'm never going to use this sledgehammer anyway, but, you know, hey, now we know it. Uh, i good there. I know there's probably an attic in here somewhere. Where would it be? In the garage, probably. Keep doing that, and you remember to switch back to the axe. Either way, there's probably another safe up there. And a body. Two more magnum cylinders. We'll take them, but we're just going to scrap them. We have a magnum. It's a piece of garbage, but it's a magnum. Scrap. Keep it for now. We'll scrap. 12 rounds. It's decent enough. Let's just scrap this one for now. And we got a bird's nest. One more bacon and eggs right there. Uh, yeah, let's pick through this. I was debating going through the wall, but... Yeah, we do have a decent axe here, so... Back something good. Uh, the receiver will take. We'll take the barrel for now. The rest of this is crap anyway, and I've got enough uh, other stuff. One more safe. Come on. Give me something amazing. I'm trying to keep an eye on the time too, because I definitely want to get out of here and get back to our base before uh, nightfall. I do not want to deal with running zombies in this blunderbuss. I really thought it was going to be a lot better than it is. I didn't bring another gun for a backup either. But either way, once we get through the Day 14 horde, we've got to start looking at a more permanent base, which means we've got about a week to make a decision, and that's either do a lot of upgrading. This is all pretty much crap. Um... Uh, I think I'm going to take this. I think the pistol grip is like the the flaw in our pistol we have right now. It's a really crappy grip. But anyway, we need something that's much going to be much easier to defend for day 21. That we probably want, actually. Uh, what do we really not need here? Hmm... Cowboy hat, sorry about your luck. Let's just toss you. The rest of this I kind of want to keep. I guess I could go ahead and read the treasure map. That won't hurt, right? Uh, you may find this. This may be your lucky day. I've been bitten by one of the creatures, and the fever has taken hold. I don't have long, but at least I could. But at least I could do before I turn is help someone. Anyone as, anyone as God would want me to. Uh, if, uh, least I could do before I turn is help someone help someone anyone as God would want me to do okay that was really hard to read for some reason if there is still a God so I leave you this map to one of my many buried supply chests 
to a new life, Sarah. All right, we'll do it. And that freed up some inventory space. And did I like magically drop? No, I dropped the cowboy down, which I didn't want anyway. But we'll take it all. All right, well, whatever. I'm probably missing something amazing in this house, but whatever. One more house to search. And a car. I see another zombie over there. I swear I cleared this whole town out before I started playing today, but... I wanted this to be a nice little simple loot run. My plan is to finish off those last couple zombies with the blunderbuss. Maybe it's me. Maybe the zombies got... Difficulties got cranked up on here somehow. What the hell was that? Well, that corpse just attacked us. Which I guess is what all the corpses are doing now. I think I already searched all the mailboxes. Alright, so I thought we would have had a way in here. I really thought you guys would have broken out. I did this for Alright, just show me all your bookcases. You serious? No bookcases. What do you have? The only thing you had anyway. Even the, even the medical test, there's no real reason for me to go into it. We have six first aid kits. We can make more. This house has more doors in it than I've ever seen in my life. Something amazing? No. Honestly, that's the only thing I want right now is schematics. I've been cranking stone into our one forge, and we're going to put up a forge room here pretty soon. But, uh... Okay, bookcases in your bathroom. Yeah, this is the one at the pool, isn't it? Oh my gosh, are you serious? Still no bookcases. Toilet gun? Does no one read anymore? I guess nobody reads here. They're all dead. Right, upstairs. Maybe they have a library. Is this the library? Ah, uh, maybe. A bookcase. With more mini bikes for dummies. Are you kidding me? All right, well, these small saves, the last one had books in it. Let me just make sure no one's breaking in yet. Okay, now we're good. I wonder how much damage that blunderbuss did to that safe. Right, we're ready with the blunderbuss on three if something does come after us. Please, please have a crossbow schematic. Then I'll worry about finding Sarah's treasure and everything else. Alright, here we go. Shotgun parts. And paper. Uh, let's eat this. Throw that away, save time, grab that. Can't seem to select the tool I want. I the bathroom, just in case, no bookcases, all right. I didn't think so, but I figured I would check. Bookcases. No, but you have retail racks. Why? Nothing. No ladder, no hidden secret, nothing. Did I miss the bookcases? Is there an attic here? Where you hide all your books? Keep them for safe. Nothing, no. There's no attic. 
It is a nice looking house, I'll give it that. Alright, computer room. Bookcases? No. No. Unbelievable. And now we're overheating too. Well, guys, I'll probably just go ahead and wrap things up here and run home. Still no bookcases, but that's where we're at. We're still no, still no crossbow schematic, but that's where we're at. So like I said, I'm going to probably just spend tomorrow fixing up our base, getting ready for the horde. I'm not going to really do much new. I'm just going to... Um, uh, just going to... Uh, <laughs> Kind of repair things and we're going to use the same plan uh for this coming horde as we did for the first horde it's honestly not going to get that much worse so we should be just fine doing that i am heading home kind of early but i think i'm going to grab grab some wood sort out my inventory a little bit and then just call it when we come back i don't know what we're going to do actually i'm we may make a run to periston and, and just see what we can do bring bring the guns we have at least there's better than this freaking blunderbuss and if we can find shotgun schematics, we can make a decent shotgun. Or, you know, at least a passable shotgun. I don't know. But anyway, guys. So thanks again for watching. I'll be uh, back again soon with more. <laughs>